99 Jams, baby. Miami's number one for hip hop and R&B. You know it's the afternoon get down with the tough guy DJ and Tice. Your girl Super Cindy. And oh. we got a special guest in the building today. <laughs> boss is in the building. The boss. What are you boss. Pour, What are you pouring me, Ross? Oh, this right here is this. This is Bumble Rum right here. Bumble Rum. You this know I'm is... Haitian Dominican. I'm all about the rum. Oh, this this your vibe right here. <laughs> I just left the Dominican Republic I, I too. Saw, I was living vicariously through you on Insta Stories and Instagram. <laughs> right. You and Santo Domingo. I was like, word, you're Bobby. over there. Oh, yeah, yeah. Of oh, course. yeah, we, we had a that. good time. We just went over there to just relax a little bit. We had a good time, though. We ate good. Ooh, this, Ooh, this, this is, is good. good. Oh, no, this is good. Bamboo? Yeah. Bamboo. Cheers nice. to the good life. You already know. You know, I, I brought y'all some 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 Bel Air, Luke Bel Air, yes. some Bamboo. Of course. Some rich hair care products. You know what I'm saying? I, you, we just repping for Dade County. Wait, right where's the wing stop? Lemon where's pepper. It, right. For real, though. Yo. Oh, <laughs> you know what? I'm finna order Delivery. us a hundred piece right now. <laughs> we finna get a hundred in peace, all flats, heavy Hell, wrench. Oh, all flats? All flats. We're Team Flats, Ross. You, you better believe team it. Flats. Oh, no, we turned up. I love we flats. You know okay. <laughs> so we're going to hang out with Ross this afternoon. It's going to be off the chain. Welcome <laughs> to the afternoon get down. Yo. Ooh. You're like our first live guest. Yeah. We had Jay Prince, but like you're here right now. No, this is legendary, though. Man, shout out to the big homie Jay Prince, but congratulations, 99 Jams, continuing to bloom. Yes. As soon as you walk out, as soon as you step off the elevator, you know it's a whole new vibe right yeah you feel you the energy right and tice he he's shining you know what i mean <laughs> beard gang beard is gang beard we here looking effect, good you, you know, know what i'm saying <laughs> getting that good money and congratulations to you cindy thank you know what I'm saying? you that took over midday you shining okay that's I shining it. bright as it. ever you know what i mean thank you you know this that winter circle right here I this feel ain't it. There. you better believe it you better believe it you better <laughs> believe it i was over there speaking espanol un poquito un poquito un poquito, un poquito. <laughs> y comiste comida dominicana. Did you eat Dominican food? I did. I ate. I, I ate. Maybe um I don't even know how many croquettes though. I got <laughs> oh, <keep croquetas. laughs> yeah, I went in croquettes. <laughs> so Ross, so much going on right yep. now. Congratulations! Yeah. I saw the video and I actually made it part of my skirt with the dirt report. Um, Fresh Prince of Bel Air with Dave East. Yeah, shout out to Dave East. Shout out to Luke Bel Air. Hey, yeah, we put that together out the in Black New York. Black Bottle Boys. Yeah, yeah we Black Bottle Boys. You know what I'm saying? So you know the, the the movement growing. Shout out to everybody that's holding us down, repping that Luke Bel Air. Rep- in Rose, you know what I mean? We just hustling. How was it doing the music video like tr- like back in the day, like um fresh like the Fresh Prince of Bel Air the shows? Like look like the nineties. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know what I mean? That was you know the the, the whole team over there at Bel Air, that was their idea. And you know, Dave V sent me the record. You know, I knocked that out right quick, flew up to New York, you know what I mean? We got the kick it for the whole day. You know what I mean? I we just were sipping Bel Air. You know what I mean? Yeah, the you video see, we did the fun. Will Smith jacket. Yeah, yeah. not nah, the vibe yeah. was the vibe yeah, on that video yeah, was crazy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I, when I saw it, I was like, I went on the air the next, like that same day. Yeah, I was like, did. Yo, the Fresh Prince of Bel Air. Did you guys Believe see that, that video? <laughs> Believe that. Awesome. Believe that. that was bossy though. That was bossy. Yeah, your green Gucci suit. Yeah, shout out. Dude. You already know green Gucci suit. Green Gucci, Gucci suit. Out you of all know. colors, why green? Right, why green? You know, I just felt like that was the one. You know what I mean? And you know, when me and Future was in the studio, we was down here in Miami. Mm-hmm. We was over in uh, North Miami at uh, Audio Vision. Mm-hmm. And the whole concept, you know, I had just left New York seeing Dapper Dan. Oh, and, the and, man. Yeah. yeah. And, and it was basically just following up on that conversation we had. You know, Eric B and Rakim album covers, mm-hmm. you know what I mean? Yes. Of course, Jay-Z, Cool G rap, you know, with them yes. double rope chains. Big with Daddy the, yeah. the big Mercedes <laughs> Benz pieces. You know, I know you know about the salt and pepper jackets yeah. he made back then. Those, <laughs> Yo. The fat boys. You know, it was like it was like once you got on and you got your money right, you had to go see Dap. You know what right, I'm saying? And that right. was the conversation we had. He told me how all the hustlers used to come drop the money yes. bag off. And, but you know. how do you go visit Dapper Dan and not just get like a hundred pieces? Because I would go bonkers nuts with Dapper Dan and getting pieces, custom made pieces. Once of he tell you those prices. Oh, you're like, that changed the game, yeah, right? Yeah, that's when you're like, you know what? I'm going to get a green Gucci suit <laughs> and I'm going to get that one and I'm good. You know and what I'm saying? good right there. Yeah, yeah. But, you know, for me, for me, what made me, you know, most proud about it is just to see what hip hop has made happen. You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. Because at one time, you know, of course, Gucci wasn't affiliated with the culture. Yes. Right. You know what I mean? Right. He used to have to do everything underground. And that's what he was explaining to me. And now, you know, hip hop, it done changed the world. 
I know, and it's part of fashion. It's of part course. of every aspect everything. of, of course, culture, yeah. everything. Of course. Yeah. When you when you when I look at Winwood, when I ride okay. through Winwood, you know what I mean? Mm-hmm. To me that's that's what hip hop did, you know what I mean? Yes. Because you know, being a B boy back in the day coming up, it was all about graffiti. Yep. It was all about yep. dancing, B boying, and of course the music. Yes. And fashion came right along with that. And those are the four cornerstones of, of the culture. Yeah, I like that. So no, you know, gu- green Gucci suit is what you got now. What's next? Because I know everybody's waiting for Port of Miami too. Yeah, Port of Miami too, man. It's finna be. You know, I'm going in like it was my first one. I feel like this right. album number ten, and you know, coming up in the city. You know, I was just happy to get the first one done. Okay. You know what I'm saying? That you already was know. so big. You, you know you Port held me down yes, on that Port yeah. of Miami 1 Super City. Yes. That you, was you so know what huge mean? when it came out. Legendary. And so, so now too. Yeah. So I felt like, you know, making this album number 10, I feel like I done came full circle. You know what I mean? Mm. And I'm just letting all the artists know when you in there perfecting your craft, that's how you got to look and think long term. You know what I mean? Even though I know we only deal with what's in our face. Mm-hmm. But, you know, everything possible. And that's what Luke showed me. You know what I mean? When I used to go buy two live crew records, I used to look at what was this manufactured, and I saw Northeast second half, second what? half. Yeah. Yo, you know what I mean? So yeah. it let me know I could be a boss. It let me know I could be a CEO or owner. Right. And that's what, you know, hopefully I'm doing for the next generation of youngsters that's coming out of the city with all this hot music. Hey, Ross is doing the plug walk. Hey. <laughs> you, know, we, you know, we the plug, man. We the plug. <laughs> better believe you know it. You better believe it. So, Ross, we got to start talking about a few things. You've yeah. been definitely on a few shows the couple, last couple days. Yeah. On the internet, Instagram, yep. social media. Mm-hmm. Yep. So, what is the situation with you and your son's mother? You know, at the end of the day, I, you know, personally, I just feel, you know, I'm somebody that's hard to get over. Right. You know what I'm saying? Oh. It ain't, I, know it ain't, that, I get that feeling. I, I'm a, I'm a, I'm a, I can understand best. that. Just, just keeping it real, it ain't <laughs> mm-hmm. nothing more than that. You know what I mean? Because mm-hmm. you know Ricky Rose don't owe nobody nothing. And you know I handle all my business. You know what I'm saying? But other than that, I think, you know, Shorty just really is hard to get over Rose. And I can't blame her. So, you know, <laughs> I'm blowing her a kiss, baby. <laughs> Let, let's hear the kiss. We want to hear the kiss. Uh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <He's> a, uh, <laughs> a fake kiss. <laughs> <laughs> so... The thing that I like, I keep wondering because you're so um, like transparent with your children. Like the MMG princess, she had her sweet sixteen, was yeah, it? Yeah. She's the MMG princess, and then you just had a, a daughter now, Berkeley. Yeah. Super cute. Congratulations on her. Thank you. Thank but you. But then when it comes to your relationship with your son, it's kind of silent because I, I'm asking you: Is it because of your relationship with her that makes? Your relationship with your son? I mean, you know, you know, sometimes, you know, it's unfortunate, but sometimes women can use, you know, your, your, your children yeah, yeah, most and let them get, you know, uh, caught up in, in your differences. Right. Mm-hmm. When I don't agree with that, and that's why I really don't really feed into it as much, you know what I'm saying? But sometimes, like, I just feel like, you know, when she cried for attention, mm-hmm. you know, that's basically what it is. You know, I done had conversations with, of course, people on her side. And, you know, when we sat down and, you know, with, you know, mediators to chop up, you know, certain business. Yeah. You know, I wasn't I wasn't trying to damage her. You know what I mean? Because she yeah. done did enough to damage herself if I was really trying uh, to yeah. attack her. You know what I mean? <laughs> if I really wanted to be, you know, v- you know, vengeful or malicious. Petty, bitter. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. <laughs> but, you know. That's not what it's about. I really feel like you know a, a, a boy needs his mother and mm-hmm. father as well. You know yeah. what I mean. Mm-hmm. And I, and that's why you know I, I kind of you know shy away from it. You know what I mean. But mm-hmm. at the end of the day, that's all it is. You know what I mean. Mm-hmm. And, and you know I know I'm a hell of a guy. You know what I mean. And, <laughs> we think you're a you know, hell. Of a guy. We saw you yeah, on yeah. Snapchat talking yeah, and you know, all you that. Feel <laughs> me, you feel <laughs> me? Saw that. And I was just I was just being honest. You know, at right. the end of the day, that's what it is. You know, she. You know. I know Shorty miss smelling that cologne. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Yeah, uh, speaking yeah. of your cologne, what's yeah. the, you, you have cologne? Oh, this this right here, nah, not oh, yet. Oh, okay, not yet, not yet. Not yet, not not yet. yet. No, I thought you not said no. Nah, not yet. But this right here is this that Rick Ross luxury beard oil. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? The shampoo, Entice will be using that. Yeah, the conditioner. Sure. You know yes. What I'm so you know, really, we just in our full fledged hustle mode. You know what I mean? I, I was traveling the world, and everywhere I went. You know, my face would be painted on the side of barbershop. So, you know, my beard really made a statement, you mm. know, and this was worldwide. So I felt like it would be organic and something that it was cool to do. So I got with a, 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 a great team, you know, and we formed Rich and here we are. 
Dope. And August 1st, we'll be in Sally's Nationwide. Woo! Okay. So, okay. You, know, you know, Sally's don't rock with everybody. You know what I mean? I, so, I right. know. I thank everybody that's been supporting us and making us a huge success. So now August 1st, we nationwide, so make sure y'all go support them. Congratulations, and you. Sally's are everywhere. Like Believe you said, everywhere. nationwide. Yeah, everywhere. Believe that. And nah, speaking of congratulations, are another congratulations in order because I saw a picture of Berkeley and her mom, right? And she looks like she's expecting another baby. Yeah, we are. We are. Woo! Yeah. Congratulations. <laughs> and it, and it, uh, you know, it's, it's it's such a blessing because mm-hmm. you know it's it's a son. You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. Yeah. So you know, my second awesome. son. Is on the way, and you know I'm gonna name him. You know my name, William. My yeah. my my first son is is William. You mm-hmm. know the third, and uh, my newborn, his name will be Billion. Oh, billion. like Billy? Yeah. No, <laughs> billion. billion, Billion. That's the only thing I wanted more than a billion dollars was another son. So God is great. Yeah, Congratulations on it. that one. You better believe it. Ross, I like the record. Oh man, green Gucci suit, man. <laughs> it has a flow, and I'm and now I understand why you pick green. Right. <laughs> you better believe it. <laughs> <laughs> you know, after you just broke the news, now that you're expecting a baby boy, which is amazing news. Um, I wanted to know how does Ross find someone to fall in love with and to be with because everybody's mm. after you for different reasons how do you know really that's just something you just got to let your heart dictate you know what mm-hmm. i'm saying mm. i just follow my heart you know what i mean of course you know um traveling the world a lot of nights you be alone so you do need that quick entertainment you did i did <laughs> but but at the same time you know when it come to you know you are human you know what i mean so mm-hmm. you do uh run across you know I've been fortunate to run across somebody that I feel, you know, understand me. You know what I mean? Dope. Somebody I could really kick it with. Somebody that's really super cool. You know what I mean? And, you know, we being blessed with our second one. So, you know, God is great. Hey. That's a blessing. So, Ross, let me ask you a question. What's up with Meek Mill? Shout out to Meek Mill. You know, he, you know, um, most definitely, you know, he just dropped his new EP. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? And, and, and Meek. I got so much respect for it because, you know, him coming home after his struggle, he's still right. being a voice yes. for everybody that, you know, he left behind, everybody right. that's still trapped in that yes. system. You know, and that go for, you know, you know, it's it's young black brothers everywhere that's jammed up in situation similar to his. And, yeah. you know, I respect him so much for, you know, continue to be that voice and using this platform for that for that bigger purpose. You know facts, what I mean? Facts, facts, facts. Shout out to Meek Mills. Meek Mill for fucking uh, for mayor. Yeah, Meek Mill for mayor, baby. <laughs> Meek Mill for mayor. Shout out to Meek Mill. Shout out to Wale. Shout out to Gunplay. Young Kesey, Young Breed, the whole MMG, the whole family, the whole squad. Rest in peace, the Black Bow. Long yes. live Black Bow. You know what I'm saying? So, Ross, at this point, how many wing stops do you own? Honestly, I don't even know. <laughs> I love that answer. Yeah. yeah. I've lost how about track. checkers? How about checkers? How many you own? Yeah, we got a couple checkers. You okay. know what I'm saying? You know, my, the one on 27th and 183rd was the very first the one official. I bought. Yeah, and that was the one that I used to eat. I used to walk right across from that shell that was on the corner. Yeah. Right down the other side where of Caramart. the street. Yeah, where Caramart mm-hmm. was at. And go over there and get me a big bag. You know what I mean? And now, as soon as I leave here, I may go by Checkers right there on 27th and 183rd. You know okay. What I mean? okay. Yeah. How do you feel about now when you go on that corner, there is no more Carol Mart and they're like building like what? 20 yeah. new stores? I'm going like- to keep it real. I'm going to keep it real. You know, you know, that's something that we all we all got to be able to do is ad- adapt and accept change. You mm-hmm. know what I'm saying? But most definitely, that 183rd Street flea market to me yes, was bro- personal. That yeah. was mm-hmm. that was Yo. personal. I remember when they had the game room on the side. Yes. You know what I'm saying? We used to go in there and watch videos. <laughs> that's why I saw It Takes Two to Make a Thing. Go Hello. Around. I saw that video for the first <laughs> time right there. So I got so many, so much history yes. to the, the, the Jamaican the lady with lot. the patties in yes. the middle. You know, Morgan Jewelers, when I used to just go lean on the glass for an hour till he told me, it's time to go, it's time to go. Get off the glass. (laughs) You know, like, I was driving down the street one day, and when I I kept hearing about that it was going to be disappearing soon, and the day that it actually was gone, I like, I almost crashed my car and made a U-E to make sure my eyeballs weren't playing a trick on me. But, I mean, congratulations to Miami Gardens, progression, and, you know, know, but it still hurts. Times change, most definitely. I love it. Miss, you know, 
you could have had two dollars in your pocket enough to go get you an orange soda Hello? and a beef patty walk through there <laughs> seen the most beautiful women in the city they had their <laughs> flip-flops on they short sun skirts or whatever sundresses you know and i just remember just all the memories that come you know travel fox the suede ballys Hello? seeing all the big hustles Everything pull up in the tudo coupe benzes <laughs> you know the, the the faux cuban link bracelets and <laughs> you know just it's you know that's just really the heart of miami you know what i mean and you know just to see it gone hopefully they'll bring something new that's historic to the table and i'm just glad you guys did music videos you and Khaled did music videos in the parking lot right, so we yeah. could just go back and Classics, watch it right. so. yeah yeah one of my one of my most recent was you know Kara City my last name should be Kara City <laughs> yeah you know my album cover for Trilla mm-hmm. that, you know I'm mm-hmm. sitting in the back seat of the Maybach that's right in front of the flea market of yeah. course we shot every damn hustling shout out to Trick Daddy his cameo was right in front of the you know y'all call it the Carol Mart we call it the flea market <laughs> the, the flea, flea market, market. Right. Believe it, believe it, the flea I'm going to the flea that's what it was the flea <laughs> you know I'm going to the flea you know what I'm saying and that's what it was man we really love that spot you know what? We just want to congratulate you on all the success with Bel Air, Bamboo, because I'm drinking it now and it's off the Amazing. chain. Believe the Rich that. Hair Care, August. It will hit Sally Beauty Supplies. Make sure you Man, go there. Make sure y'all support it. Y'all can pre order it right now. You know what oh. I mean? RichbyRickRoss.com. Yes. But August 1st, we'll be in Sally's nationwide. And Port of Miami, too? Port of Miami, too, coming real soon. I'm putting the final touches on that. I'm going to the studio as soon as I leave and here. And I'm but following you because I will be on the, I you gotta, be on you gotta do that too. intro I'm you doing gotta, that intro I don't care what you say intro, but you got to no, we, I was there the for one you know what I'm saying <laughs> we want to thank you Rose much love family man. for stopping by and just being honest and open and we appreciate you Ross you know you fam Come at on, any Sunday. time anytime <laughs> and I just gotta salute the whole team over here at 99 Jams for continuing to grow I remember this was right on the side of the 826 better believe yeah. it. In the hood. Yeah, that was right in VG Venetian yeah. Gardens. That was the hood for real. You know what I'm saying? That's Care City for real. But just to see what we at now, now y'all got ice cream machines when you, know, you walk you in. Know. And, you know, y'all doing it big over here. You know what I'm saying? Crushed so, ice yeah. in the machine. So shout out to the whole team. 99 Jam, still the hottest in the city, baby. Don't better believe it. We it. appreciate your support, Ross. You know how we do it. It's the afternoon get down. Driving huh. five is up next, yo. Hey.